All praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to Apostles and Elders in New York, GMS, and salutations to you, uh, Akim, that's teaching the truth uh, across the world. And um, shout out one to you, serious Akim Akwaf, that's uh, reading the scriptures, you know, studying, um, looking at our videos, um, enduring to the end of Esau rulership, Esau, the so called white man. All right, and uh, what's well, important to have faith in Yahweh, while Yahweh Shah. My name is Maya Kaala Nagab with the Chicago branch of GMS. And, uh, you know, uh, recently I just, uh, about yesterday, basically I got a wind of uh, Kali Muscle uh, basically rejecting uh, the truth basically rejecting um uh, his 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 god uh Yahweh and his son uh Yahweh Shah everybody Itinri calls uh Yahweh Shah Jesus and Yahweh God. Alright. Then uh, he uh rejected his nationality of Israel. He basically he rejected um the most high and see you know, it's not about Cali Moses, it's about uh, the whole nation of Israel. All right, particularly with uh, what I meant to say, like the two thirds among the nation of Israel, uh, this mentality they have. Um, you know, uh, you know, I was growing up, uh, young man, like my teenage years and, uh, and uh, upward, you know, uh, when I woke up. Um, into the truth, you know, um, even before I wasn't working with the truth, you know, I was into, uh, you know, history, so-called black history, you know, I went deep into it, like, uh, so I then, you know, um, what's that guy named, Seti, and, and the rest, I didn't get too deep into it, man. You know, I just had like the basic knowledge, you know, uh, you go about accomplishing with the Moors and, and, you know, so on and stuff like that. You know, I didn't know they was Israelites at that time, you know, but just uh, different inventions and stuff, uh, the compliments of so-called Negroes, you know, and, um, you know, different uh, civilizations that was, you know, dark-skinned, you know, uh, whether it be Israel or Ishmael, you know, and so on, you know, so, uh, you always think, I always encounter Jake, you know, they come into such knowledge and stuff, you know, which is not taught in, uh, Esau's education system. They all had saying, you know, this not going to pay my bills. This not going to do this, not going to put no rims, no rims on my wheels and stuff, you know, or, or they say, it's not going to do that. The same thing I mentioned, not gonna do it for the kids, you know. So, you know, our people always uh, saying foolish things, you know. And then, uh, like he said in the video, what did he say? Let me see. God just won't go over what he said. All right. No, what? All right. So the one the brother asked him, "Do you know he's an Israelite?" So who cares? Get money. All right. And another thing, you know, um, another way our people say what I uh, mentioned before, what they always say, you know, it's not gonna pay in real when you tell them you're they you're there is like, you know, they always say, um, "Who cares? Get money." Or they say, "No, that's not gonna pay my rent, my bills. It's not gonna put rims on my cars and stuff." You know, they say it don't matter, but I understand it, man. Like the other nations, and they know their nationality. And they still being prosperous, man. Look at the Ishmael. All right, so I'm going to go right here. It says the richest Arabs. All right. Most of the time, it's talking about Ishmael. All right, or might be talking about uh, the other nations got influenced by 
uh, Ishmaelite culture, Arabic culture, you know, uh, Iran, which is Elam, and, you know, other nations up, up in there. You know, but based on talking about Ishmael, so-called Arabs, the people that actually go back, bloodline go back to Ishmael, and see, they, into their culture, all right, they got they, uh, you see, they wear traditional clothing and everything. They speak, they speak their language and stuff. All right. And they still, they're prosperous, man. You know, so, you know, our people just foolish, man. All right. Now, you could be an Israelite and still uh, basically function. Well, I mean, function, you know, you take care of yourself, your family members, uh, and poorly the occult. You know, your congregation and stuff. You know, you could do that, man. But you're not going to uh, prosper like these elite, man. You know, I'm talking about the elite. I'm talking about like the, uh, you know, the Rothschild, the Rockefellers, and the other heathen nations, the top family of the other heathen nations, man. You're not going to prosper like that. You know, the most I'm going to give you what you what you need, man. What you could, what you could handle that time, man. Because when Jake get money, man, you know, they lose their damn minds, man. You know? And they, they dwell into the world, man. You know, the world really don't want them. You know? Because you go to Psalms 83, Ishmael. Ishmael's listed as Israel's enemy, man. These are the guys that, that uh, traded with Esau and Ham. You know, Esau, so called white man, Ham, the so called uh, Africans. We read Joel, Joel 3 1. When you see that movie Roots, man, it's these guys, man. All right? <laughs> they could be, they, they, some was just as dark as he, man, selling out people, man. It wasn't about being dark skinned, man. It's about being a, a certain line of sea, man. They knew that we wasn't a people, man. They knew we wasn't Ishmael. They knew we was Israel, man. All right? But again, you know, you see these guys, they, they, they speak their language, they worship their God, Allah. They wearing the clothes and everything. All right. They know the hell they are, man. All right. By people, man, they seem they, they so stupid. You know, they just say foolish things, man. All right. Being an Israel, being an Israelite. Is the greatest treasure in the world, man. You you chosen on the most high, man. You know, and I'm gonna play it where he say he talking about class. Yes, this is all about classes. This is all about classes. Do you uh, first of all, Kali, man, and, and rest you so called Negroes who think like that, say things just like that. You're not of the elite class. You're not of of uh the elite Edomite class, man, the Rockefellers, the Rothschilds, the uh, DuPonts, all right, based the 13 uh, Illuminati bloodline, all right, and the word Illuminati means enlightened ones, enlightened ones, man, because they, they uh, basically know what's, what's, what's going on, they had the history, everything, man, they had the history, you so-called Negroes, Latino, Native Americans, uh, they had your history, knowing that you were the Israelites, that the Bible speak of, you had the history of other nations, man. Uh, Moab being the Chinese, uh, Amun being the Japanese. All right. So, you know, they illuminate their way. Also, they do illuminate it. Uh, like, you see all these, um, <clears throat> you know, certain historical events and stuff like that, how things really is and stuff, you know. Uh, another thing, you know, like they illuminated with the, you know, the little signs and stuff you see, I see little logos and stuff, you see the different businesses, man, they know what they mean, they secret messages, you know, they basically know what the normal, they basically know what, um, nine and a half percent of the population don't know, all right, we brothers in the truth, the, 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 the um, uh, the Illuminati on the right hand side, Illuminati means enlightened ones, all right? We know what's going on on the right hand side. Also, you know, our evil counterparts, the Edomite elite, they know what's going on on the left hand side, all right? So there's like a small percentage in the world, all right, who truly know what the hell, you know, we know what the hell going on, but the rest of the 99% of the world, they don't, such as uh, Kali Muscle, 
you know, Kali Muscle, uh, and the rest of the people, man. All right. He told my class, <laughs> you know, Israel is the, 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 one, the, one, the nation of Israel is, is, is the, the top class of the other nations, man. See, this is not this is how people don't know don't know the scriptures, man. Alright. Let's see, uh Deuteronomy. Let's see. He always talking about God, God all through his video, man. He don't know nothing about the most high. All right, it says Deuteronomy uh, chapter, chapter 14, verse 1. All right, he told my class, it says, What well, ye are the children of Yahweh, your power. Ye shall not cut yourselves, nor make any baldness between your eyes, what it did. It says, For thou art a holy people unto Yahweh, thy power. All right, Yahweh had chosen thee but to be a particular people unto itself, above all nations that are upon the earth, above all. All nations that are upon the earth. All right. And holy means separate, man. Kadash means separate, man. Okay. So the rest of the people ain't shit, man. All right. Those who think who uh, think like Kali most talking about class. Israel's the top class, man. <laughs> you know, we're the ones who, who going to uh, inherit the earth, man. All right, we want to gonna be on top, man. We read uh, what's this? Let's see, uh, fourteen one. So he don't know what he talking about, man. Uh. And others like him. It's not about Kali Musk. It's about the, the typical two thirds, man. All right. It says Isaiah 14 1 said, For Yahweh have mercy on Jacob, was Israel would yet choose Israel, set them in their own land, and the strangers shall be joined with them, right? Many the, the strangers mean the other Israelites from you know, around the world, man. The song of Lula, other nations, man. All right. They should come to the truth, man. All right. <clears throat> It says, uh, and they shall cleave to the house of Jacob. All right. Also, it's talking about the, uh, uh, the confusion of faith. You got some years like to like other nations, but there's like how their forefathers are so called Negro, all right, so called uh, Native American, Latino man. But basically, it's like, man, because our people went around the world, man, traveling the world, and they had, have, um, the males had, um, Children by the other heathen nation. Guess what? They still is like, man. All right, you go by the seed of your father. All right, Numbers chapter Numbers chapter one verse one all the way down to eighteen. All right, it says, and they should cleave and cleave to the house of Jacob. Okay, yeah, they're gonna be with us. All right, it says right here. It says, uh. Isaiah chapter 14, verse 2, it says, And the people shall take them and bring them to their place. All right. And, and uh, it said, And the house of Israel shall possess them, the land of Yahweh for service and handmaids. <laughs> it says, uh, And they shall take them captives, who captives they were, and they shall rule over their presses. All right. And them was talking to the other, the other heathen nations, man, the so-called white man, the so-called, uh, which is Esau, all right, uh, so-called uh, Arabs, Ishmael, so-called Af uh, uh, so Africans, Ham, all right, so-called East Indians, Elam, all right, so-called uh, so uh, uh, Polynesians, Hawaiians, all that, Japheth. All right, anybody outside the nation of Israel, man, they're going to serve us, man. <laughs> you know. It says, uh, it should take, and they shall take them cap who captives they were, and they shall rule their presence. Right, we was these, these people captives, man. They had us in slavery, man, all throughout history. 
right. It says, and it shall come to pass in that day that your house will get de from thy sorrow, from thy fear, from, from